the Duchess of Cornwall, 73, discussed the monarch's love of horse racing as Royal Ascot kicks off today. Camilla, who attended the first day of the famous meet, also praised the Queen's encyclopedic knowledge on the subject. Speaking to ITV Racing, Prince Charles' wife said, Well I think this is her passion in life and she loves it, and you can tell how much she loves it. She could tell you every horse she's bred and owned from the very beginning, she doesn't forget anything. Camilla's comments come as the monarch is watching the racing on television from Windsor Castle today. Her horse King's Lynn is running in the King's Stand Stakes on the first day of Royal Ascot. The Queen's racing manager John Warren has said she may attend later in the week. Mr Warren told BBC Radio 4's Today programme, Obviously the Queen would love to attend, as you know she's fanatic about racing, watching racing and breeding horses, and has been going to Ascot all of her adult life. So, it's a shame to miss an event. The plan at the moment is to see how it goes towards the latter part of the week and if the Queen's able to come because she's got runners, then, fingers crossed, it will happen. Mr Warren also described Her Majesty as fanatic about horse racing. And he praised the Queen's incredible energy levels despite being just five years away from turning 100. The monarch's racing manager said, it's remarkable. The Queen's energy levels are incredible. She's 95. She went down to the G7 this week, and trundled back on the train in the middle of the night and the energy will be raised higher again for a week like Ascot. The Queen has a number of runners at the Berkshire Racecourse, with Mr Warren tipping tactical in the Jersey Stakes on Saturday as a potential winner. Racegoers are being welcomed back to Royal Ascot for the first time since the pandemic began. Punters dressed in glamorous dresses and hats and smart suits will cheer on the jockeys over the next five days. However there will be no traditional carriage procession unless the Queen makes an appearance. Ascot was staged behind closed doors last year but this year was selected to take part in the government's events research program on behalf of the sport of racing. Each day 12,000 racegoers will be allowed to watch the sporting spectacle after providing negative COVID-19 tests.